You sure that's a good idea? Ah, okay. Dr. Pedro Dominguez is an archaeologist and expert in pre colonial Maya history. My father mentioned him in his notes more than once. That's the lead Jonah and I were following up on when we came to Cozumel. His excavation in Cozumel was one of the last places my father visited before he was killed. If there is a connection, I want to find out what it is. I thought that Dr. Dominguez was only the leader of the local Trinity cell. I never imagined that he would turn out to be the leader of the High Council of Trinity. All right, well, we got our villain. Ooh. Yeah, that's as I mentioned earlier, I've, I've actually been to Peru, and I've been to the Amazon jungle in Peru as well. So this is, um, well, not, not quite this deep in the jungle, but, you know, I, I, I've been there. And those howler monkeys, that was a howler monkey that ran up there. They uh, are actually pretty terrifying. They, you know, you think yeah. monkey, it's just going to be a little cute little monkey, you know. No, no, no. These things are big, they make a lot of noise, and they are rather aggressive. And we lost all our gear too. Could be useful. And, oh man, walking around here it, with your bare arms exposed like that, no chuffing way. I'll keep this for later. I mean, I get, I get bitten by mosquitoes, you know, here in Europe, but there, oh my, they were ridiculous. Everywhere and freaking huge. Uh, Alright, I've got a bit turned around here and it's so easy just to get turned around like that as well. because everything just looks the same. And you have no survival instincts like this, you know, to just show where a quest marker is. They really got to invent that. I mean, how cool would that be if you had like those uh, those Jonah! glasses that Google were making? Can anyone hear me? I mean, that would totally be an app that I'd invent, you know, trademarking it right there, Hello? you know. Hook it up. You could hook it up to a GPS and then like, you know, you tap the button and then bang. Oh, there's your destination. You know, that would be... That would be awesome. They'll even tie it up to a supermarket as well, you know. Put your shopping list in there. Just go around the supermarket tell you where all the... where your waypoints are. Where are they? I have to find them. Come on, you're telling me you wouldn't buy that? You heard it here first. Uh, yeah, we are... we are really in trouble here. Okay, let's have a look. Where are we? Ah, hello. The Silver Crown Mountain. I'm getting closer. Not that close. Someone's over there. I have to get to them. Okay. I don't want to go down that way. Okay, so I guess we're near the river too. What do we got there? Feathers. Use feathers to craft arrows and restore outfits. Okay, cool. It's a long way, Lara.
Yeah, those guys. They don't just sit there like that, I'm telling you. You start going into their territory, yeah, they start making that sound in here or there. And it gets louder and louder and louder. And it is, uh, it's Howlers. pretty intimidating. Oh, that's part of the plane. Oh boy. Oh, gross. A fire. Someone must be around. Hello? Jonah? Miguel? Can you hear me? Miguel? Where are you? Is Miguel dead? Can't do anything there. Oh, we've lost our knife and everything. Huh. Handkerchief. The monogram reads P H F. That has to stand for Percival Harrison Fawcett. Okay. And uh, do you want to elaborate on who that is, uh, Laura, or? So we're gonna have to figure that out. Oh, cool! Is this our first uh, campfire? Hmm. All right, let's uh, let's sit. I didn't know the storm would hit so hard. This is all my fault. I should have listened to Jonah, thought it through. I never should have taken that dagger. I hope no one else was hurt. No other village destroyed. I need to stop these cataclysms before it's too late. I think you're being a bit hard on yourself there, Lara. I mean, how are you supposed to know that picking up some old knife is literally going to cause the end of the world? Uh, anywho, so uh, we've got two things unavailable. Um, I guess the one on the right is... Uh, fast travel, not sure about the middle one, uh, but we got skills. So let's have a look here. Okay, training in Seeker enhances Lara's uh, exploration and observation abilities. Warrior increases her combat and weapon abilities, and Scavenger enhances her crafting and stealth skills. Gotcha. Choose a skill to learn from any blue, red, or green colored box. Or white outlines have already been purchased and mastered. Dark boxes are unlocked when an adjacent skill is purchased. Some skills must be found in the world and cannot be purchased. Oh, cool. Okay. That's what we've got to spend here. We've got three skill points to spend. So let's start down here because there's only... Let's start here. There's only three, four to go through. Okay. So this is the warrior in the red. Out of speed. Ne never slip when grabbing ledges. More reaction time for traps and grappling enemies. Okay. Uh, reduce fall damage. Okay. Uh, visual assistance when aiming at enemy's head. Mm -hmm. Reach full draw weight more quickly. That could also be interesting. Two skill points there. Bow's coil. Automatically loot enemies killed by a stealth takedown. Viper snare. Craft lure traps on enemy corpses. Attract and kill nearby enemies with a shrapnel explosion when triggered. All right. Uh, increase breath capacity when swimming underwater. And form a stealth kill takedown without alerting nearby enemies. That I like quite a lot. Uh, five pins nest. Increase the amount of man made crafting resources gathered from each source. Mm, those, these ones are always better to get early on, I find, as well, because over the long run they're going to get us more gear. So mm, that's also tempting. Uh, increase the chances of finding rare animals. Gain the ability to harvest dark poison and venom from spider and beetles. Harvesting requires makeshift knife, which I don't think we have. Locate the heart of a large animal while using survival instincts. Heart shots inflict massive damage. Good to know. Reveal artifacts, monoliths, treasure chests, ar archivist maps, and explorer backpacks while using survival instincts. That's looking pretty promising. And build challenge objects when using survival. Okay, so I think I know what I'm going to go for here. 
Uh, we're going to go for this one to reveal artifacts and things. How was that unlock for us? Reveal traps, poison, survival instincts. Okay. And I do like the. Um, uh, which one was it? The stealth kill one. Wait, well, that was here, wasn't it? Yeah, perform stealth kill attack, but I'm not sure we're going to be doing it. We're kind of lost in the jungle. I'm not sure we need that at the moment. So I'm going to go for this one, Viper's Nest. Increase the amount of man-made crafting resources gathered by each uh, from each source. So let's do that. Okay, and what's that unlocked for us? Serpent's Glint adds a flare round attachment to all pistols. Flare rounds ignite unarmored enemies and blind surrounding enemies for a few seconds. Hmm, okay. Right on. And we can't do anything else. So let's let's move on. Part of the plane landed here. My gear is in that cargo. I'll need to cut it down. Alrighty. How are we gonna do that? We need something to cut that down. Hmm. Okay. We're going to need a sharpened object. Might be a sharp piece of scrap in that section of the wreck. What section? Over oh, there. I can't even open those boxes at the moment. Okay. Maybe a piece of scrap from the wreck. Oh boy. Damn it. Yeah. Are we going in? We're going in. <laughs> That's a new one. Maca leaf. Uh, red leaves underwater maca leaf used for healing. Good. Let's grab a quick breath before we. But, Lara, you want it? There we go. Oh no, not this guy again. Ouch. Okay, so we got our knife. Good, but it's dull. I need to find something to sharpen it. Are you kidding me? Oh, okay, we've already got two out of three. So need another salvage box. Saw some of those things. How do I can I attack them? Where did you go? Oh, through there. Yeah, those giant rodent things, they are huge. That is pretty accurate scale as well. Uh, is that what we need? No. Ah, was that it? There we go. Exactly what I was looking for. Just need a bit more. Really? Okay. Got everything I need. Should head back to camp. You got it. Hmm. What do we got there? Uh, Nicandra, flowers found in the jungle's canopy used for perception mixtures. Okay, cool. So why can I jump up here then? Oh, okay. Oh, okay, we need another four of those. Let's hop for them. Ah, it's our inventory, okay. So let's craft that. Good, okay. Uh, what else we got up here? Equipment, got a bit of rope. Uh, ooh, outfits, cool. Okay, tactical adventurer. 
benefits craft additional ammo and bonus XP from stealth kills. Okay. Robes of Pukahook. Uh, benefits of health regeneration and animal resources. Could be interesting. We're in the jungle. Uh, gain uh, additional plant and mineral crafting. That could also be very interesting. Um, gain bonus XP from hunting animals. I guess there's going to be a bit of that. So we'll have a look at that too. Uh, let's have a look at these all. Okay. Bit, uh, bit Horizon Zero Dawn, but I'm digging it. Adventurer. Pretty standard. Uh, that's from... The face change too. Yeah, a bit. That's from the first game, I think. Or well, the first modern game. Uh, remnant jacket. Yeah, probably a bit warm. Pretty cool. Yeah, alright. No benefits to these ones, though. These just cosmetic. Uh, infiltrator. Alright, alright. Siberian Ranger. Yeah, you're gonna sweat to death in that. Shadowrun. Pretty cool, too. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's... Awesome. Uh, another jacket. Pretty classic. And <laughs> okay, well, that's uh, from one of the older ones, I guess. Going even older. Uh, okay, okay. <laughs> Oh, nice touch though. That's a cool addition. Benefits again, okay. Uh, bonus XP from hunting, cool. Increased focus time. Hmm. Time slowed for longer period when aiming requires scales of the serpent skill. Do I have that? Okay, well, let's go back on the... Uh, which one did I like? Yeah, that one. So let's have... Uh, oh, that's, I didn't want to come out of that. Let's go to skills. So have I got scales of the serpent skill? How am I supposed to tell if I've got that? A story reward, okay. Scale of the Serpent, Scale of the Serpent. Well, I might as well just check the ones I have, and if I don't have it, then it's not worth it, is it? No, I don't have it, okay. Serpent seems to be over here, though, mainly. Vestige outfits require fewer resources. Hmm, okay, or vestige. Okay. All right. Well, I don't know where that one is yet. Then. Anywho, but that's one. I like the the bonuses there. That should be sharp enough. Right. Yeah. Next game. Okay, so let's learn of skill. Uh, what was the other one I like the look of? It was... So I got that one and that one, didn't I? It was the uh, stealth kills. Hmm. Do I want to go for that now that we're here? Hmm. Let's try and look to see if there's any I want to go for. Like, after... We uh, we learn one. Uh, no, I don't think there is. So I think I am going to go for that. Yeah. Okay. Kill a second enemy during a stealth takedown to perform a chain takedown. So it's like two at once. Hmm. All right. So let's get chopping. Something still holding the supplies up. Uh, yeah. Ah, there's a second rope tethering them. Yes. Now I can get my gear back. Finally. Are they the beetles we can kill anything? <sighs> I 
No, you didn't want to fill the case in. Why didn't I pack all my equipment together? <laughs> uh, okay, fine, fine. Miss Croft, anyone? Come in, Miguel. Where Miguel? are you? Really? Damn! Oh, I thought he was dead. Didn't he get like smashed in the face by a hailstone the size of a golf ball? Okay, that's where we need to go. All right, all right. Well, we got, well, we got stuff to explore around here. So when we do that, like this. Hmm. Is that a ledge over there? Hide. Use hide to restore outfits and upgrade weapons. Let's restore outfits. This is a, a new one. Ah, there's something up there. Didn't that? Ah, there it is. What was that flashing thing? Uh, oh, crypt discovered. Explore crypts to discover the secrets. You bet I will. Okay, so... Cusco belongs to Hernando Pizarro, rightful representative of the Spanish crown. Diego de Oro has been captured. Rodrigo Orgones is dead, and the rest of their heretic forces routed. We made a crossing over the mountains and appeared on the coast outside of Cusco. Orgones marched to meet us at Cachupampa, a poor choice for his cavalry. His falconets threw Gonzalo's infantry charge into disorder, but the swampy ground prevented his seasoned cavaliers from true advantage. Our imperial arquebusier breached the river and unleashed hellfire on the opposition. Pizarro and Orgones led their respective cavalries, each merging to a single charging column all of the men yelling and met at full gallop. I had never seen such a thing. Somewhere in the chaos of battle, Gomez was shot and unhorsed and killed. They say the coward Almagro retreated from the battlefield atop an ass. Fitting. Excerpt from Alonso Luiz's journal. Cusco is a beautiful city. It was probably the, my favorite city I visited when I went there. I was there for a wedding, actually. My One of my girlfriends married a Peruvian girl. That was it. Was awesome. Great trip. Uh, okay, let's get in here. Hold R2 to craft silent arrows. Okay. Ah, cool. Could do it on the fly. All right. Was that someone up there? No. Yeah, you guys should have cut the rope, shouldn't you? Careful, careful. Me too. Oh, aha. There we go. That's what the guys up there should have done. Yeah. I'm going to tell you this quite a lot, aren't I, Lara? Laura. Lara. Sorry, I don't know why I keep calling her Lara. Jack's Journal 2. 30th of oh. May. This morning we entered uncharted territory, leaving the sun bleached bones of dead horse camp behind. It seems the tables have turned on rally, almost quite literally. 
His bandaged leg has slowed his pace and made him the tail of our party. When father notices, he slows, turning around to give us both an encouraging smile. His overly eager step betrays his calm demeanor as he rushes past us at the sight of every nearing turn, ridge, or embankment. Hmm. Did we miss one? Uku the Scout. May Ergu be the one to chart the path from this life to the next, so that we may all travel safely. I guess that will take us. Shit! Ooh! Oh boy. Uh, am I dead? I think I might be dead. I'm dead. Yeah. I know, I'm a pretty, uh,. Pretty good Tomb Raider. Right, should we, uh, should we try that one again? Pretty sure it's all going to be open. Um, yeah, what was I saying then? Careful. Caref Careful, they're already dead. Don't worry about them. Um, we're not going to have to find everything again, are we? Yeah, I reckon that's just going to lead us around there. Be a little more wary here, shall we? Wonder where this will lead. You know where it's well, I know where it's gonna lead. Oh! <laughs> okay, slow, slow. I thought that would be right, is that thing here again? No, it's not. Okay. Collectibles stay with us. So, look out for dodgy floors like that. Shit, indeed. Okay, let's try this again. It's better. Gently now. Okay, yeah, that looks... Yeah, okay, that's the other side of that path, isn't it? This seems to describe a hidden chamber nearby. Really? I'm trying to get the light so I can actually see it. Okay, it looks like there's a fallen, well, place where you can fall in, I guess. Well, that doesn't look safe, does it? What do we have here? Ooh, big chest. Or grave? Gear acquired. Feathered boots said to be worn by Queen Even Evening Star. Oh, cool. Uh, some outfits give gameplay benefits when worn. Mm, okay, I'll have to have a look at that there when we go back to base camp. Yep, narrow crack in the wall. Oh no, we're not swimming again, are we? Oh. Okay. Oh man, looks like there's more to it that we're not going to be able to get to. That's got to be the way up. Nuts. That was a waste of an arrow. I don't know why, I always like to kind of get it in the middle of the... Uh, middle of the thing there. So 
we're going to have to come back with our uh, climbing accent, aren't we? I love these tombs though. Um, well, I really enjoyed them in the previous ones where you get one and go in and it's just like... Well, I was hoping for a bit of a puzzle or something, you know, but uh, well, maybe there is in the, the extra bit down there. So yeah, it's that way we need to go, isn't it? Oh, challenge to him. Okay, okay. I'm up for a challenge. <laughs> 